Happy Sunday. Can you guess what time it is? Ice cream time! Just kidding. But on the topic of that, we're learning about goodness today and I have a question for you. What is good? Can you tell me? What's good? Well, I think ice cream is good, my day is good, I'm good and feeling good, and I do good things, but are these things always good? No, ice cream, when left out, is bad for you. Your days aren't always good, and you don't always do good things. God doesn't just order us to be good, similar to when we're told to be good. Have you ever been told to just be good? Well, God isn't pointing his finger and saying that. He's not like, be good, kids. He's saying, hey, come to me, love me, and let me love you. Listen to my voice, talk to me, prayer, get to know me. I'll show you my goodness and fill you up with my goodness and watch how your heart and life will change. Your mind will be different too. The thoughts you'll think will be good thoughts and your actions will follow because my goodness surrounds you. So, what is goodness? Goodness is our trying to do good and good as best as we can with the excellence and never changing goodness of God. That's a lot of goods. <laughs> but we can't get goodness out of our own power. It will always fall short or not be enough. But that's okay because we get it through the power of God, which is his Holy Spirit. Look for it in Philippians 2.13. So today, if you're online, grab your grown-up or in person right now. C3 Kid Teachers, are you guys ready? They'll stop this video in just a bit and give you guys some time to talk and do a super fun activity like eat ice cream. Just kidding, no ice cream. So Trish, what are you trying to tell me? Trish is me. Well, I'm glad you asked. I want to tell you how to be good practically, how to have goodness in your heart, not just to do good or to be good. So I have one word for you, generosity. Generosity helps us have goodness in our hearts. It helps us keep God in our heart. So just three quick things. One, be generous with your time with God. Give Him your morning before school or your last hour before bedtime. Two, be generous with prayer. Talk to God, listen to Him, pray for your family and friends. Three, be generous with your physical gifts allowance, your toys, sharing. So if you have an allowance, what does it look like to tithe? Or practice this with your parents at church. Okay, okay, you got that, right? C3 kid teachers, grown-ups, it's pop quiz time. Did they get all of that? I think I have some paper in the back. Just kidding. But I'd love for you to walk away from today understanding more of God's goodness towards you and for you to grow as we've been growing in the Holy Spirit, as we've been growing in the fruits of the Spirit, to grow in goodness and generosity. Okay, now it's time for the super fun activity, vision boards. Well, what's a vision board, you ask? Well, I'm gonna hand it off to your grown-up or your C3 kids teacher, and they'll